Yo, what is up, my people on the YouTubes or the Instagrams? If I decided to share this on my Instagram story. So I haven't created a video or posted a video, same thing, in a while. And that's because I literally have no content. Um, I've been waiting on parts for over a month. And I've also been trying to deal with other things in my life. You know, um, YouTube isn't the only thing that uh, I'm pursuing. Um, it is one of my main things I want to pursue. But, I mean, you know, sometimes you just have to uh, um, get your priorities together. Anyways, I'll get more in detail with that later. But first, um, gotta go fix an issue on the camera and you guys will be tagging along for that. So the last time you guys saw it, I completed the SE conversion, but I had an aftermarket SE grill. Now I went back to the OEM LE grill and I plastic dipped it. And to be honest, it looked better than the uh, SE grill, the aftermarket one at least, because I was having fitment issues. Not only that, I've been hiding these wheels from you guys for a long time. Probably since I got my uh, custom dual exhaust. Um, yeah, I, went, I didn't want to put them on until I lowered, but I decided, you know what? Let me just put them on for now. And actually, my mom actually uh, convinced me to put them on. My mom has said something on the lines of, man, you, you paid for the wheels. It's like, might as well get your money's worth instead of letting it, you know, collect dust in the garage. And I was like, you know what? You right, ma. You right. Yeah, these are Kazera wheels. Kazera, Kazera. I don't, I don't know how you pronounce it, but they are five-spoke wheels, which is something I've always wanted. Five-spoke wheels with, you know, a lip. Um, they're 18 by eight and a half with a plus 35 offset. Anyways, I'm just gonna show you all the issue now. So see the lights. Our right, turning signal is nice and bright. The low beam on this side is, you know, pretty bright. Um, now turning signals on, low beam headlight does not work. Now I wanted just to buy another LED bulb, but I've actually already bought a replacement LED bulb for this side. Like this side's LED bulb went out, so I got the replacement for it. Now, after a few months, this one went out and I don't feel like purchasing another replacement bulb. They are projector headlights, so HIDs are better uh, for projector headlights and LEDs anyways. Um, and in some cases, halogens are better for projector headlights and LEDs because they at least shine bright in a 360 pattern while LEDs is like, um, it's mostly just like, you know, front and back. There's a light right here, light right here. Make sense? With that being said, I'm gonna put in the old halogen bulbs. I don't know why I got so excited for that. And the only reason why I'm putting in halogens instead of ordering HIDs right now is because a young man's broke. And I know a lot of y'all feel that. And you can lie and you can front as much as you want, but 90% of car guys or car people, sorry, I know there are like two of you females following me, um, are broke. And I know most of you guys are college students. Maybe, I don't know. I've only seen around people my age subscribing to me. Whatever, let's just get started. So if you watch Eliminate, you know this should just be pluck and play. Shit, Whoa! Whoa! Dude, I was wondering why the back of my hand hit something hot. These LEDs are scorching hot. They like, I can't believe it's like a copper color now. It used to be just like a regular, like metallic, you know, that's kind of dirty, but a regular metallic color. Now they're like nice and crispy. Um, Yeah, I don't think I'll be buying products from them anymore. Okay, so I just took out the other side, and to be honest, these are even more burnt than these. I mean, yeah, this one hasn't re been replaced yet, so I guess it makes sense, but I can't believe, like, they just go out like that, you know? 
So like I've had these only for like maybe six months. Um, but if we're being honest, I have I have not run it for like six months worth of time, you know. But I've owned them for six months. I can't believe I'm having an issue with this. You see how this one still has the housing on, or whatever you call that, the collar. This one does not because it is stuck in there, as you can see. Okay, so I got it out. It was like cooked on. I had to pry it out with a flathead. One of the, uh, Jesus, I just had the word for it. But one of these like clips, there were supposed to be three, uh, broke off and I guess it's stuck in my headlight or in my engine bay, but I don't care. I'm gonna just install the halogens. I'm not gonna record that because I think that's pretty self-explanatory. All right, so just finished installing the halogens. And to be honest, I'm not upset at all that I had to install these again because at least I have one LED bulb on each side and that looks pretty cool. Oh, and I think it's cool that I have four different color lights and I'll show you what I mean by that right now. Okay, never mind. Three different color headlights. I thought my high beams were different from my low beams, but no, they're pretty much the same. So I have that, you know, regular yellow peaches co peach color, that bright white, it looks blue on camera for some reason. And we have that nice yellow fog light. So yeah, I'm gonna be running like that for a while. Before we go inside for, uh, you know, updates, um, just have to always admire my rear end, my car's rear end. Um, because I don't know, this is my favorite part of the car. Even though I get OCD about it, kind of pissing me off, knowing that I painted this and it's not like, I guess professional paint, but spray can, but yeah, that's gotta be my favorite part about the car. Just gotta admire it. Oh yeah. That's what we like. See ya. Yo, it'd be hot as balls, man. All right, so I'm using the front camera, so the quality might be worse. Um, Let me start with the car stuff. So, I've been waiting on BC Racing coal overs for exactly a month now. Well, a month and a day. Um, and with everything going on, you know, because of elections and whatnot, the post office slowing down is like, I really don't know when I'm gonna get those, but um, that was supposed to be my next, you know, video when it, uh, relating to cars. Um, and I've also been waiting on a sticker. That's always a cool mod. Man, I don't care. I'm gonna just use the back camera. The quality's pissing me off. Um, so, and yeah, that's it about um, really the car stuff. I mean, besides the Culver's, I want to actually bring my front lip to Mako to paint it because um, when I was trying to uh, tape up the front lip so I can paint the the fog light housing black because I actually painted the fog light housing uh, white um, because I couldn't tape it yet. Anyways, um, yeah, I want to bring it to Mako and because you know accidents and like paint chipping off all this stuff. Um, yeah, those are my next two things when it comes to the Camry and um, I'm kind of holding off on everything else I want to do to it because I haven't even got those two things done. Plus, if I order anything else, it's just gonna come like way later than the coilovers and the stickers anyways, or shoot, they might even come like all at the same time around Christmas. And this is no shot to anyone that works at the post office. Shout out to you. On to updates about this channel in general. Um, when I first made this channel, it was actually supposed to be a, a fitness channel. But um, during when I first started, you know, I didn't really have many resources and my creativity wasn't really what it is now. My videos aren't even that creative, but I mean, so just imagine how worse it would have been if I started um, back then. And I actually made this channel my senior year of high school, if to whoever's wondering. Um, and yeah, so for that, Last video that I uploaded, my leg day video, is like, for those of you who think it's random, um, yeah, so it was supposed to be a fitness channel and now I am beginning to do that as well. So that's another reason why I haven't uh, been making videos because um, I've been using my time to try to uh, 
become a sponsored athlete for this uh, supplement and you know fitness lifestyle company. And to be honest, I was really excited about it, um, but I don't think I can go through with it. Um, just for the fact is like, you know what? Um, to start off, I thought they would be uh, providing me the products, but then uh, I'm actually got to purchase them myself, just you know, uh, as a start. But um, right now, COVID is going on, and I recently quit my job because uh, I needed something new, and I needed um, you know just a new environment. And that's as much detail as I'm gonna go into it. Um, so yeah, the, the becoming a sponsored athlete wouldn't have given me you know guaranteed money like right away. Um, it was gonna be, it was gonna take some time, and I can't really afford that right now um, because my following isn't even that big on Instagram. Like as a matter of fact, it's pretty small compared to like. You know other youtubers or just even regular people i have like 737 followers i'm not even at 1k um and you guys see my subscribers on youtube i only have 40 of y'all um hopefully i can get another one or two after this video um but yeah so you know what i'm most of my time will be focused on this channel you know i, I won't be very successful for uh, a long time but I genuinely love making these videos I think they're fun and I, it's some way I can express my creativity and um, it's kind of like um, a diary I guess it's kind of like would be to say but it's, it's almost like a diary so it's like I can look back at these things like wow I did that wow I painted my car wow um, I broke my car yeah I think that's about it. Oh, that wasn't a diss to any of my subscribers or my followers on Instagram. Uh, I appreciate you all and I love you all. And you know what? Um, I think it's cool that you think I'm cool enough to even like want to see on a daily or almost on a daily you follow me on Instagram or you think I'm cool enough to even like watch as a matter of fact. Um, yeah, I appreciate, I appreciate all you guys. I appreciate the genuine support and I appreciate uh, those of you subscribers who are my friends and subscribe to me just because I'm your friend But I hope you guys actually end up enjoying what I put out. So I'm gonna leave y'all with a message today um, Chase your dreams. Don't be afraid to chase them as cliche as it sounds um, The easiest way to do that is taking it uh, by the day and winning each day and then hopefully when you add all that up You get a Sean Wednesday now I'm just playing. You will get your goal. All right, I'm leaving you guys with that. Peace. Wait, whoa, 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 wait. Um, if you like this video, give it a like. If you know anyone that would like me or my videos, share this with them. Or if they also just like, you know, small struggling YouTube channels, share this video. All right, now you guys have a great day.